ever talk about how good God is. I've been in a lot of narcissist relationships, but this last one was life changing for me. You'll be somewhere sitting like a sitting duck, a sheep among wolves, and you don't even know that you to pray. And with God's protection, even though you could be in danger or it could have been danger around you, when God protects you, you don't even feel the fear or the negativity that's around you. You don't even know the plans the enemy made to destroy your life and how they mock you and make fun of the fact that they are out to just to destroy you and you're just being used to give the enemy what they want. And really after they give what they want, they was gonna discard you anyways. That's the work of an evil, some evil wicked people. Maybe they never got to know how to be good people in life. And even if you was done deeply wrong and you lived in poverty and you had nothing, it's not good to envy other people because they have a little more than what you have. And you think because if they have a little more than you, do you have a right to sabotage, to scam, to get what they earn? What they got is their blessings. What they got, you never know how hard they work for. And you really don't know how much a person have just by looking at a person on the outside. But yet, in your mind, you was determined to destroy a good person because of your greedy, selfish needs. May God have mercy on you. The bed that you lie down for somebody else is the bed that you're going to lie in and you're going to reap what you sow because you and whoever wicked people have no right to try to destroy a person that has nothing to do with your mindset, nothing to do with the way you live, nothing to do with what happened to you. It's not right to blame people, especially innocent people that came along to try to help, not destroy, but help. It was not Eve on the plans that was made behind their backs. But it's all good. Because some people that do that to people don't know. That person knew God. And God knew secrets. And plans. That we didn't know about. So God either turned us away from them people. Or let them turn against us. In order to save our life. Our mind. Our insanity. What the devil wanted, he didn't get. That's because God is faithful and true to those that don't believe in him. I'm a walking, living testimony. I was like a sheep in a wolf's den. And I had no idea what was around me. Because God was with me the whole time. And yes... I owe the Lord my life, no matter what people say. I know what God has done for me. And I just want to spread the word so folks can know. No matter what you was told, God is real. Believe that. I hope you all find salvation, peace, and happiness.